Your photos, your hashtags, your social media posts, putting your children in danger. Tonight, how you are unknowingly making your child more susceptible to online predators. CBS 12's Lulu Ortiz joining us live from Jupiter with the mistakes parents are making without even knowing it. And Lulu, this is important for all parents to hear. Well, proud parents love posting pictures of their kids and babies on social media. Many of these babies facing the camera, others wearing no clothes. Now, they do it innocently enough, but experts say that parents don't realize that anyone could search for it through hashtags, even predators. Bathing suit pictures and <laughs> inappropriate stuff like that. Trisha Frigo does not allow her son, eighth grader Anthony, use any social media apps. I think that things have gotten out of hand with pictures where they're being shared with uh, other people that they don't know. It's important to monitor what your teens are doing. And tonight, experts are teaching Jupiter parents an important lesson. When it goes on the internet, it is always on the internet for the rest of time. Experts warn that the photos some parents post of their young children's lives on social media can pose as a dangerous threat. By hashtagging it, it's making it searchable, allowing predators to view these images of children. The founder of Child Rescue Coalition, a nonprofit that aims to protect children from sexual exploitation, says there are three common hashtags that are searchable by a child predator. Hashtag potty training, hashtag naked kids, hashtag kids bathing. Almost half of the predators in their collection have images that they've taken from social media networks. Right now, hashtag potty training has over 471,000 uploaded photos on Instagram. Most of these kids are not fully clothed. It's only really a matter of time before online abuse turns into real life abuse and they start abusing children that they have access to. Now they also recommend that parents and their teens should ask themselves questions before posting anything on social media like, why am I sharing this? Another thing they advise tonight is to check the privacy settings on all social media platforms. We're live in Jupiter tonight. I'm Lily Ortiz, CBS 12 News. And there are other steps you can take to protect your family. Cell phone companies like Verizon, AT&T, and Sprint have safeguard apps that allow you to locate your children anytime, view phone activity, prohibit the use of the camera, and set age restrictions and block certain internet content. Those apps are free.